Taylor just ran me through the global TV workout that we're doing tomorrow with Mike. And uh, it, it's a good one. It's a full body workout. And uh, yeah, I figured since instead of me explaining this, I'm gonna get Taylor to do it because I just I can't really talk right now. So. <laughs> All right, let's do it. All right, starting their first exercise is a curtsy lunge. Keeping that torso nice and upright. Core activated, we're just doing a step behind. So whichever foot you're stepping on is the weight is going to be placed onto that foot, keeping those knees as close together as possible. All right, you're going to be feeling some of your glutes, adductors and abductors, care of the time. Going into the second movement is a plank jack, so I'm going to be coming out, stepping into a plank position, hands directly underneath your shoulders, core again nice and activated. We're just jumping the feet out and in. We want to tone this down a little bit. We can step one foot out at a time. If you want to get a little bit more cardio involved, jump those feet right in and out, and then out to the plank. Again, core activated the entire time. Third movement, interim with a push up, standing upright, coming down, can bend those knees a little bit, get the stretch in the hamstring, come out to the push up position, push up at the bottom, and then you're pushing yourself back up. Again, if you need to bend those knees, coming back down, do the push up. Feeling the chest, shoulders, and arms. Okay, last but not least, we have the break dancer. So again, you're gonna be in the plank position. Hands directly under your shoulders, core nice and tight. Here to kick through and back into plank. Kick through, come back into plank. This is too difficult. Drop it down to your forearm, kick it through, feel more stability throughout. 